it's embarkation day. Embarkation day. It's embarkation day. It's embarkation day. But that does mean it is our last day here at the beautiful Ulani Resort. Sad time. Hawaii. Very sad time to be. But the new adventure starts today. It does indeed, it does indeed. So what are we doing today, Ali? We're getting on the Disney Wonder. Yeah. So uh, we were all checked in. Um, there was a um, desk that we had to go to yesterday, wasn't there? Um, we got our luggage tags. Yeah. Um, we're on the Donald coach. We're on the Donald we paid bus. for coach transfers to the port from Alani, so. Yeah. Um, so they gave us some um, luggage tags. We left our room, our bags in the room, um, and then someone's come and collected them, and then they will magically appear at our stateroom. Room. Yeah, on the cruise. Can um, we just uh, appreciate these t-shirts, by the way? Yeah, I got them from uh, Truly Magical Gifts that I saw on Instagram. Yeah, very nice. Go check them out. Very fitting for a Disney embarkation cruise, but they've got loads more other things on there as well. Yeah. Yeah. And they're nice because they're embroidered and not printed. Yeah, so they won't wash off. Very nice. So, we will see you on the cruise. See you on the cruise. Bye. We're just in a convoy to board the bus. All checked in. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Um, this motor coach will be traveling to Aloha Tower, which has the Disney Wonder. It will take about 60 minutes, so please sit back and enjoy. Well, Oh my god, this is all mad. Gravy. We've been given lays. We have. Everyone's screaming. Everyone is. Ah! Oh. The lays, we got all the lays. All the lays. Oh, these are fresh, yeah, fresh flowers. Cool. I got a hug off Goofy. They're all going crazy. What energy? What energy? We made it. We made it. Disney one of please welcome all the two family. Disney please welcome the Oh, that's Pluto now. So we've made it on board at, it's only half 12 and we're already on. We've got the Lays, another Lay. These are real. They smell amazing. Yeah, they're real flowers. They smell lovely. Real fresh. It's crazy. All that was just a bit of a rush. Was. A bit of a mad panic. But oh. we are here. Aloha. We're going to go and explore while it's a bit quiet Definitely. and get photos in front of the front. Woo. We've made it into Cabana's, the buffet restaurant, and we've literally just picked up anything and everything. <laughs> so, macaroni cheese, chips, turkey, chicken, chicken tenders, chicken fried rice, broccoli, Beef, deep fried beef and noodles. It's a whole plate of beige, isn't it? Yeah. So we've got the pork stir fry, macaroni cheese, chicken tenders, that's a battered cod, oh. lamb chop, sirloin steak, Two chips, chicken mashed tenders. potato. Mm. And this is where we're sat. And then this is my favourite place on the ship, Cove Cafe.
How are you? I'm good. I'm good. good. It's nice and cool in here. <laughs> it is. Compared to outside. Yeah. So that was all a bit of a whirlwind. We've now relaxed. We've had lunch, we've ate at Cabanas, and we're now at the adults only pool. We've been in the pool, yeah. and now we're just chilling. But this is where we are. If you come to the after the ship, this is where all the drink stations are. All included. My favorite. Mmm, the juice. So you've got all your milk, coffee, hot chocolates, and other cups. So I think the room's ready. Oh, here we are. Welcome. Welcome. Oh, we've got another bag. Another bag. Um, Mickey Lanyard. Yeah. Oh, hi. Fancy seeing you here. Come on in. <laughs> Come on in. So, this is our stateroom for the 13 night voyage across. Uh, so, starting off just here where you come in. If you go with this first door on your left, this is the toilet. Uh, so you've got in there some storage, the toilet, sink, mirror, some towels. You've all, I've just noticed as well, so Disney are getting rid of the H2O products and they've started putting stickers over the H2O trademark. So I wonder if it's already changed or they're getting ready to. There is a really old style hairdryer in here <laughs> with a shaver plug, but there is a new style hairdryer in the drawers as well. Yeah. So that's the first door. The second door here to the second door is the shower. Uh, so it is also a bit of a bath, but it'd be a very tight, small bath. Yeah, but like if you've got kids, it's yeah. okay for bathing the kids, isn't it? Definitely. Uh, you've also got another sink, uh, some more mirrors, a washing line, uh, some towels, a bit more storage underneath the sink. Makeup mirror. I've just had a go at this body lotion. It still smells like the H2O product, so I'm gonna say it still is. And then they've also got the body wash, conditioner, and shampoo, and a makeup towel. Yeah. In here then, we've got some wardrobe space. So plenty of hangers, the life jackets, the Just a note as well, you can have more hangers if you ask your stateroom host. Yeah, uh, some more hangers, a safe, a bit of storage, laundry bag, the ladders for the bunk beds should you want them brought down. Over there. Um, a few drawers here, uh, some nice artwork, uh, some glasses, there are Starbucks mugs. They don't come with the room. <laughs> uh, you got a full length mirror full there. Mirror there. Um, the world's comfiest bed. The world's comfiest bed, yeah. Uh, with what? American plugs that side. And what have we got this side? Short? I was going to yeah. say, what? What's short? that button down there? There's two buttons. Uh, Light. Oh, so that's like the master switch. Yeah. And that's for the uh, side lamp. And you've got your telephone. Yeah, and you've got another American plug down there. Oh. You've got plenty of storage under the bed as well to store yeah. the suitcases. They're my flip When the suitcases are out. Yeah. Uh, TV. Uh, which can swivel, I believe, to come this side or that side. I'm led to believe as well that Wonder's just been in to dry dock and I believe they've replaced all the TVs in the rooms. Some more storage. Yeah, mini fridge. We'll be putting all the water in there. We've got uh, some more outlets here. So I think they're are they all American as well? I don't yeah. know. Yeah, they're all American. Are they? 
What's this oh, one? Oh, no, that's European. Yeah, that's European. European. These are American, American. Oh, I think these are American and European, looking at it. Yeah. That's they're USB. That's European. He's a bit sad. <laughs> He's very sad. Uh, some more drawers. There's ah, your new hairdryer. Heat proof mat. Uh, some more drawers. I think this has got the this station ready. Yeah. So you get given. Oh, so this is to order your breakfast if you want it delivered into the room. You just fill this out, don't you, and hang it on the door by 3 a.m. Yeah. Yeah, and then tick off what you want and they'll deliver it. There you go. Um, you've got a pen, an envelope and some letters in case you want to write a letter home. Some complimentary postcard with Mickey in the clouds. Nice. Um, the water that we wore down yeah. the city. Some more drawers, I don't think there's anything in this. Yeah. Uh, this little coffee table moves. Oh yeah, so... This turns this... into bunk beds, doesn't it? Yeah, so... One thing you'll say about our room, we booked a guaranteed veranda room. So... A lot of the other state rooms haven't got this sticky out bit. The bunk bed actually comes down from the ceiling. Um, as I believe this room's slightly narrower than the others. Um, but that turns into a, a bed as well. But because we booked a guaranteed state room, it was a hell of a lot cheaper. Um, and then we've got onto the balcony, a white wall veranda. Most of the other verandas have got, um, is it plexiglass? Yeah. But it's a bit of an odd shape because we're on the curve of the ship. Yeah, so it's wider here. I, I don't know if it's wider than the normal balcony here or not, but then it goes narrower there. And then that's out to the back of the ship. US Coast Guard. And Lulu. There you have it. So when you get on board, if you connect to the Disney Wi-Fi and load up your Navigator app, it'll connect, ask you to link your stateroom up, and then it'll show you where all your dining and onboard charges and characters, daily activities. It'll show you where everything is on the Navigator app. We're just in our mandatory evacuation drill, and now it's time for the sail away party. Onward to Australia. We've made it down to Mickey's mainsail and white caps, and it is rammed. Everyone's after our exclusive merch. Two per guest, they've all gone. Oh my god. Look at Stitch. Max. <laughs> It's well soft. Oh my god, it's very busy in here. We've got exclusive caps for the crossing. They've got it. 
Yeah, I've got, got the pins. wonder to go with the thing. Yes. We've got these 25 anniversary pins that Gary wanted and Adam wanted. It is mannequin here. Everyone's after the exclusive merch. Look at the two. Candle holder. Yeah, that's, it is. Holder. that's Aww, cute. That is cute. What are these? Milk chocolate. Magnet. So, we've just. So. They're the Mickey's Main Trail. Chaos was in Mickey's Main Trail. And this is White Caps. They've obviously not got any exclusive merch in here. <laughs> nice, nice. I can't buy another spirit jersey. The Disney Wonder Spirit jersey. Disney Wonder Spirit jersey. It's a nice bit, sorry. We've got a uh, lounge fly, Disney Ooh, Wonder yeah. lounge fly, that's nice. That is very nice. What's on the back of it? I assume the same pattern. Yeah, no, yeah. just on the same pattern. How much is it? $78. That is crazy. Oh, they've got that print in a shirt. Nice. Disney Wonder shirt. That's very oh, that's all. That's all the. That's all the. Shit. Oh, what's this? Notebook. Oh, that's a lovely notebook. How nice is that notebook? That is nice. Oh, the five ships. That's quite cool. Look at the Christmas decorations. Hmm. Smooth sailing. Is it what is the thing that like, um, no I like a clip back? Is that photo album? What is it? I think a photo album, yeah. yeah. Shorts, they feel nice. Looks evil. It looks like two eyes <laughs> and a mouth. <laughs> you get a little plant to put in your stateroom for you cruise. Oh my god. Oh uh, wow, that's cool. Now, we've got a pin board at home. We have got a pin board at but home. But it's just a standard cork board. cork board. That would be perfect for that. That would be good for that. Wouldn't it? Yeah. $40. Oh, and you can hang it up as well. Yeah. I mean, we've already exceeded our luggage limit so far. Yeah. Nope. Don't think you belong in here. Come on, back to that. The show. Oh. Okay, so these charms. Just... Mm. Everyone? And then they've got a bit of a random corner of pharmaceuticals. So we've got a slight issue. One of our bags hasn't arrived yet. So we're just heading down to guest services to find out where it is. Hopefully it's on the ship and not been left in Hawaii. This is the French Quarter Lounge. Tiana's, oh yeah, there's Tiana's place. So just past Tiana's place, French Quarter Lounge. This is where you can get Mickey beignets from. And I believe this had a bit of a refurb upgrade. I think they got rid of some of the fences when it came into dry dock. But you can buy Mickey beignets. They have a live entertainment here. Yeah, it's just a nice lounge area. And then it's dark at the moment, Hi. but you can look out to sea. And there's the bar and coffee. Bag located. It was at guest services. They'd wrote suspicious on it. I think it's because the label had fell off. 
So, but I had to open my case up in the lobby. Everyone and saw my pants. So we're just heading off to Animator's Palette for our first dinner of the cruise. Ooh. It's a bit rocky. <laughs> Welcome to Animator's Palette. <laughs> 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 See you inside. By the way, my voice is going because I've been screaming too much at the sail away party. Sorry? I think they are new menu holders. Yeah. So I've got the free shot up. And Max has got the chicken bastilla? Fila? Which is um, basically spiced chicken uh, wrapped in a phyllo pastry, sprinkled with I think ice and sugar and cinnamon. Cinnamon, yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I don't need to explain mine. It's bruschetta. Bruschetta. <laughs> <laughs> Here's our main. I went for the lighter option of salmon, mashed potato, and veg. And Max has got the halibut. When we were in the shop earlier. Um, getting all the merchandise. Oh, hey, Goof. Um, the what they do is they put out all the initial merchandise in outfits. Hi, good evening. Um, and then, kind of, once it's gone, it's gone. Um, but they do have like more in the back. Um, so what they did is they had like a bit of a, like a wish, wish list kind of thing. So you left your name um, and your state room, room and like the item that you kind of wanted to get. So we put that we wanted some pins. The um, exclusive, yeah, the exclusive, yeah. the exclusive <laughs> merchandise for the inaugural cruise. All the pins went within three seconds. It yeah. was carnage. So, um, but they had some in the back, uh, and they've just sent us a message on the um, cruise liner to say that they have been successful in putting us to a side. So we're just coming to collect them now. Pins are quiet. So we got the are. pins. We've not seen them yet, <laughs> which is quite funny. The wrapped up. <laughs> Can I just say two pins, forty-five dollars. Olives. Are we ready? Oh, I like it. It's nice. Oh, and there's a little kangaroo <laughs> and a... Is it a kiwi bird? What Maybe? is that? I, I think don't it's a know. kiwi bird. So, try and focus on it. Do we need to do that thing where you put your hand in? Is that a thing? <laughs> there you go. You can kind of see. Here's our door. <laughs> <laughs> this is next door's door. It puts our door to shame, but look at the cat. <laughs> so that is embarkation day Ugh. done. I'm knackered, but we were up at 4 a.m. Yeah, yeah. We found out there's a happy hour for beignets in the morning. Five dollars for a coffee and two beignets. Which is good. Mm -hmm. um, that and is that good. is from. 8 o'clock. Yeah, where um, the. What's it called? The oh, French Quarter Lounge. Yes. Good night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. Uh, we've just picked up the Disney Wonder Photo Challenge of the day. So, what it does is it gives you a load of little snippets of some fine or. Um, logo from around the ship what you have to do is you have to fill it out as to where the signs are and then return it to port adventures and i don't know if you get anything i hope so but we'll see so we found that one that's outside the cadillac lounge which is just down there this one i think is next to cove cafe this one's like a dvc logo 
I think that's by the um, French Quarter Cafe. Oh, yes. Don't know what that is. Don't know what that is. That's some kind of pirate something. Pirate something. I recognise that, but I don't know where that is. Oh, that's Pinot Pinot Pizzeria. Yeah, that's Paolo. Paolo, yes. That's Donald of some sort, I think. I don't know. Mm. Signals, Sully Sippers. We're smashing it. Okay. So, that one. There. <laughs> Max thinks he's found one, but I haven't got a clue. Oh! Eh. Uh, that's different than that. Is it? Yeah. The lines and everything. I may have stopped off at the shop during our photo challenge. I think it's that there. What is? This one here. So it's a small world nursery. Uh. Ah, hello. Good morning, everyone. Well, it's now day four. I know. I'm sorry. We left you on day one. And we haven't filmed anything. Uh, we've just been enjoying the couple of sea days that we've had. Max has gone and got us a table at the French Quarter Lounge because they are doing a Disney Park trivia quiz and it's already started. So come with me and we will go and see them. It's already started. We did terrible in that quiz. We didn't do great. We only got 11 out of 20. Yeah. Which just surprised me because I thought I was quite good, but clearly not. There was quite a lot about the Asian parks in there, wasn't there? Like Tokyo and Shanghai yeah. and yeah, and obviously we've never been, so. Uh, but no, it was a very good quiz. People took it very seriously though. They do. They do. Like, they were hardcore seriousness. Everybody come on down. Here we go. Oh, here we go, the room after the crossing the equator party we're now in the southern hemisphere and we've got these on our bed curious so we always get two chocolate feet tonight anyway chocolate, they chocolate. Go the chocolate pile. but these, what are these cast crew after the disney league final is here that you could join the round table with this Teams. Lovely, lovely, yeah. Open that. What's in this? What's in this? It's a print. I think it's a print. Is it a print? Ooh. Oh, a certificate of what? Oh, authenticity. Oh. Uh, Mickey and Minnie wishing you good day. Uh, Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse wishing you good day. So. It's a crossing the, the equator, equator from, from Honolulu, Honolulu to, to Hawaii. Hawaii. Sydney, Australia. Wow. No one yeah. else other than the people on this cruise will have that. Correct, yeah. Wow. That's so amazing. So how many total editions? Artist total edition, 1,700. Amazing. Right. So, someone just posted on the... Facebook page that we follow that they've brought out a special crossing the equator pin for today. So we're running down to the shop. The crocs are still wet. <laughs> Is that it? No. Good morning from day seven. Like a Disney wonder. I know, day seven. I'm sorry, we haven't really done any vlogging since we got on the ship because we've just been chilling out. And I don't really think just chilling out would interest people. 
Yeah, because we've had literally 70 days from boarding the ship to now. Yes. Uh, so. We have arrived in American Samoa this morning. Pargo, Pargo. Let me just quickly turn you around to see. So this is the view from our balcony. We're on the side where people are getting off and on. Uh, but I'll show you the other side in a minute. We were greeted to some dancers this morning, all standing here. But this is the first time that Disney have been to this part of the world, so everyone was very excited and was greeting us and dancing and singing. Lovely. So we're not getting off the ship. I know that's bad, but lovely, lovely. Stay on the ship. Um, we're going to give you a bit of a ship tour. So come with us and we will explore the Disney wonder. Trying to think of where to start the ship tour. So we've come to deck three aft, which is the back of the ship. And I thought we'll work forward, up, back, up, forward, up, until we get to deck 10. Just to note, we're starting on deck three because deck one, two, there's nothing to really see there. They're both uh, state rooms, but the medical center is on deck one, isn't it? Yeah. And there's also the Disney Vacation Club area on deck two. These are the deck three aft staircases. So deck two goes down to there, deck four. And in front of the staircases are the lifts or elevators. Make your hands on. The next to the elevators, lifts, you've got the restrooms. Which then leads into Tiana's, which is closed. Obviously we're at port. And directly across from Tiana's is the French Quarter Lounge. All right, we are halfway there, everyone. How oh, we're doing a bit of a quiz. Really so, kids, we're here. That's all that matters. And what I didn't tell you, but we are playing with some of those Chippendale medals. Has anyone got a medal yet? Oh, you're the person to beat, sir. He's got a medal already. Mm. You say, no, you're not. Which tribute did you win? Triple knowledge, yeah. I'm terrible So, in the French Quarter Lounge, they serve All right, the let's move on to beignets. Number 11. They're not the Mickey the shape, movie, though. The movie, The One and Only Ivan, about a gorilla who befriends a baby elephant. There you go. There's the prices for the beignets, beignets from Tiana's Bakery. 175, one beignet, two, True 275, three beignets, 350. These prices are all in sure dollars as well, by the way. 50, 50, they do a happy hour in the French Quarter Lounge for beignets, where you get... Coffee and two beignets for five dollars. A speciality coffee, two beignets for five dollars. And that's at 8am in the morning? 8am, happy hour, beignets. If you keep walking past the French Quarter Lounge, you've got another set of stairs which go up to the D Lounge, Vista Gallery, Shutters and our Animator's Palette. And then here's one of the entrances to Triton's. This isn't really the main entrance though. It's a bit rainy today. I wonder if you can see in. Okay. So that's Triton's. So if you keep walking up, this leads into the main atrium, where you've got the main atrium. So those doors are usually where people get on, on your embarkation day, and you're greeted. This is the main entrance to Triton's. Here's Ariel. Mm -hmm. 
and then in the main atrium you've got the guest services and the other side you've got the port adventures which will look after excursions and everything but you can also pick up they do like a daily scavenger hunt there you go there's one so today is the photo challenge so Oh no, they're the answers. Oh my god. Yeah, that's not this one. Don't look at that's them. You're gone. But you get the idea. Don't look at the answers. No, that's not for today. This will be for yesterday. Oh. So they show you yesterday's answers so you can see how many you got right. Or if yes, you didn't but what if these people haven't done that one yet? Well, don't look. Don't look. But you get the idea. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, the paintings. Behind the main atrium, you've got your lifts again. And then these are the midship, midship, midship staircases. Either side. And then if you continue going straight down, you come to the after hours area, which is the adults only uh, bar. Bars. Yeah, adults only section in the evening. Is it past what six o'clock? I think so. It's very nice. You've got Crown and Fin Pub, Cadillac Lounge, and Azure. They also do. Oh, it's shut. But they also do activities in Azure throughout the day as well. Karaoke, that's not for me. But here you can get a little photo app. There's little seats you can chill out in and watch the ocean. This is the Cadillac Lounge. It's closed at the moment. Everything's really shut because we're at port. But there you go, there's a sneak in. And then the other side of the Cadillac Lounge, well, in the middle, you've got your forward lifts, elevators, and your forward staircase. Here's the Crown and Fin pub, a proper English pub. Got your English telephone box. No phone in there, though. This is where they usually put all the sports games on if you're a sports fan. And they also have a late night buffet going on. You can also pick up board games from here. What's that? Oh, someone's left. Summer Fridays. Someone's left their lip butter bomb. This was a shop, it normally is, but I asked and it's currently being used as storage, merchandise storage, I think, because obviously our crossing is going to Australia and they've got a lot of merch. So I'm sure normally you can buy dresses, can't you? Yeah. you know, princess dresses and things. Sea treasures, isn't it? Oh, there you go. Yeah, there's the name of it. Sea treasures, normally. Yeah, you can buy like costumes and dresses for that one, normally. So then if we go up one flight of stairs to deck uh, four. four. <laughs>
deck four forward now. You will get lost just so you know. And there's the Walt Disney Theatre, which you can't go in yet. And um, has that side got a bar? Oh yeah, that side has got a bar. Oh, yeah. but there are the toilets. They're female. They're female toilets, bathrooms. And then the other side, they're the male bathrooms, toilets. And then that's where the bar is. There's a bar on each side, isn't yeah. there? No, I've seen it. But deck four as well is where you also access the uh, promenade deck. You then come to the Mickey's Main Sale and White Cap store. And then they also do photo ops here with some of the characters. So this is Mickey's Main Sale. The stores are closed at the moment because they're closed on port days. There's all the Australian merch, New Zealand merch. People been going crazy for. Would you say White Caps is more of a clothing store, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Well, it looks like it. Clothing and homeware. Yeah. More designer, isn't it? Where more designer. Yeah. So in there, you'll find like your Union Berg. Oh yes. Yeah. You watching the new jewelry. White caps is where you get the golden Mickeys and the uh, Wonder ship models from. Then past the shops is the midship lifts and staircases each side. You've also got restrooms each side here as well. And this goes into a little balcony to overlook the atrium. There's a seating area. A fun fact we learnt as well, all these characters represent a role that someone does on the ship. So you'll see Daisy making beds, and Kiki with the binoculars, and Mickey making food. I'll just show you on deck four promenade as well. <laughs> this is probably my favourite place to sit because you get really comfy chairs. And especially on sea days, just sit here watching the ocean go by. This is also the jogging trail, but I didn't know there is a direction of jog. Day one, we were going against everyone and I wondered why everyone was hating us. So the direction of jog is that way, which is the front to back. So the three laps on this track is equivalent to one mile. Just for all them avid joggers out there, we did one lap of walking then decided to sit down and have a coffee. And there's a staircase down to the atrium. You've also got the entrance to D Lounge here. And there's some could be upcoming activities. set it up for something in there. But they do a lot of trivia crafts and stuff in there. Just down from the D lounge you've got the Shutter's Portrait Studio and then the kiosks. If you bought the photo package or people take photos of you on board you can come and view all the photos in this kiosk. You just touch your Keep the World card here and they all appear here. When it went into dry dock, they 
got rid of a lot of the shutters and then turned this area into a new jewellery store which has got all high-end jewellery in obviously there's no prices on them oh that's nice Oh, there you go, Diamonds and Wishes, that shop's called now. Uh, as you come out of there, you've got the toilets again, which then leads into Animator's Palette. And then we're at the aft elevators and stairs again. So let's go up again to deck five. Five lifts, toilets again. And you got your popcorn stand. Because this then leads to the Buena Vista Theatre. I won't go in because I think there's a showing going on. But on this level is it's a small wood nursery. Hello. Hi. When it came into dry dock, they redid a lot of the public carpet areas and you can see the colors are so vibrant on them. And then we're at the top of the atrium in here, which is deck five. So you see over there that passage where that person just walked through, adults aren't allowed in there. That's only the kids area, to, which connects them from the Oceaneers Lab to the Oceaneers Club. There's only the cast members and kids allowed in there to connect them between the both so they don't have to come into the public areas. And an interesting fact, on deck five, the ceiling is a lot smaller because this is where most of the kids' clubs are and the Imagineers designed that so the kids felt like this was their level. Make them feel more grown up. So this is the midship lifts and stairs and then that leads into the Oceaneers lab in the middle. The Oceaneers lab is currently open for everyone to come and visit. Wash cycle complete. So they've all got little rooms to go in. Animator studio. Oh, maybe they uh, can do all the drawings. I assume they can trace off things. Craft studio. Have they been doing a craft wall? Following our path? Oh, yeah. <laughs> ports of call simulator. Oh, go from Castaway Key. Oh, what ship are you going to have? Obviously the wonder, gotta be the wonder. Ah! I have no idea what I'm doing here. Go! Oh, we've already crashed. We've made contact. Not very elegant, that said. I'm at 75 knots here. 
Um, well, steaming. But now we've discovered it's open house at the kids' club, so coming back to the Oceaneers Club. Oh, we'll ask. Oceaneers Club is an open house today. It's just the uh, Oceaneers Lab. Can't pretend to be a kid for the day. <laughs> so that's where we've just been in. And then this side. There's a long corridor. Here are all the artwork, not artwork, photos of when the Disney Wonder was being built. <laughs> so that leads us on to... Oh, there's more state rooms more state rooms down there next to five forward lifts and these are the five forward stairs and we go up again one six did you say six seven and eight yeah hang on here's a ship map yeah so six seven and eight are all state rooms, level eight is your concierge rooms and suites, you lucky people. But you've also got laundry facilities as well on six, seven, and two by the looks of it. So we'll go straight up to nine. So we're at nine forward now which is where the forward elevators are. You've got a little seating area here. There's restrooms over there. And then this side, you've got the census spa. And the census spa is where the fitness studio is as well. I'll go in and have a look if there's not much, many people in there. The gym, fitness area, just to the left, follow the path around. Follow the signs. This is where the rainforest room is as well, by the way. If you've got that pass. Male and female changing rooms. By the way, they've got a water filter station here as well. Water refill station even, for filtered water. And then into the fitness room. So come out of nine forward, it leads straight into the adults only area but when it's not raining these all have comfy mattresses on there's hot tubs From there, you've got Cove Cafe. Then, past Cove Cafe, you've got the main funnel vision. Cool. They do a lot of meet and greets here with characters underneath this bit. And this is a cue for it. Are they playing phrase? Two!
this is where all of the quick service food is from as well on deck nine. So you got the Pinocchio Pizzeria. Also, where you can access the concierge lounge. I'll take you as far as I can go because we're not that privileged. Maybe one day. So here's the concierge lounge. You lucky people. <laughs> and this is where vibe is. Yeah, vibe is in one of the funnels. I don't think we can go in there though. Um, what time are we? What time are we? Twelve two. No, not yet. It doesn't open till one anyway. So vibe is vibe the teens? I think so. Yeah. Vibe is teens, and it's actually located within this funnel because that funnel is the only functioning one they have. This is just for decoration. And then this mirrored area is the concierge lounge. One thing I've noticed on the Wonder compared to the Magic is the concierge lounge seems to be a lot bigger. And I think they've extended it recently because, let me just show you where it goes. So the mirrored section is the concierge lounge, but they've also got the upper deck area reserved for concierge guests, and I'm pretty sure they haven't got that on the magic. Forward deck 
10, you've got the sports, uh, is this sports something? Wild world as well. Oh, there's that thing we were looking for. We did a photo challenge and we couldn't find that flat. But I found it now. But this wraps all the way to the front. Oh, I know one thing we haven't shown. And then just in here, at the very top, of the forward lift staircases is the Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique entrance. And there's only one elevator which goes up to deck 10 forward, and it's this one. So if you want to go up to Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique in the lift, you'll have to use the very far left elevator lift because that's the only one that goes up to deck 10. So that concludes the tour of the wonder. Um, that was a very quick tour of the wonder. Yeah um, it was. I'm but sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Um, I can really show you a bit of a glimpse. You can come and explore it for yourself. Yeah I hope uh, we gave you a bit of an insight. Catch you in a bit. So we've had a day in American Samoa. We didn't get off the ship. No, nope, because food cool. and drinks included. <laughs> um, and we're now on our way to Paolo for dinner. Yeah, fancy, fancy. So we'll let you know how that goes. Awesome. We've made it into Paolo. Although we said our reservation had been cancelled. <laughs> I don't know how, but we didn't do that. So here is the menu. Would you like a lemon? Is there some lemon for your water? I'm okay, thank fine, you. Fine, thank you, I'm fine. This is an amuse bouche, which Max has already eaten. <laughs> Potato gnocchi in a mushroom sauce. Mushroom sauce. If they're warm. Now we've got the bread service, which they've made right over there in the kitchen. So we've got focaccia, garlic focaccia. Yeah. And then, oh, that is garlicky. Wow. Yeah. And then there's some like bread thins bread and thins some bread and sticks. So our appetizers have arrived. I've had the tomato and mozzarella. And Max has had the calamari. But I was just saying, he's got like a whole octopus there. <laughs> it's calamari and, the and a jumbo shrimp. Jumbo shrimp. Second starter, of course, has arrived. I've got a whole bowl of rocket. And some parmesan. And some parmesan. And Max has got a mixed leaf salad with um cherry tomatoes and a Prosecco vinaigrette. Lovely. Oh, um, the man thought something was wrong with the calamari because he couldn't eat it all. But it was such a big portion. And oh, I want to say you make from a chocolate souffle. Exactly. And for the main, we've both gone for the beef tenderloin with a red wine jus. Okay. Is it video? No pressure. <laughs> wow. Mm. Enjoy, thank you. Thank, thank you. you. So we've all seen what Max has got. The chocolate the souffle. Chocolate souffle. And I've got the lemon cello tart open house at the Oceaneers Club. Club. 
and this is the kids club where you can come in but they do open houses where adults can come in and experience it as well so let me show you around this is the main hall bit and then off each hall i mean look at this they've got a slinky as a slide it's so cool can i get down the slide Going up the stairs. Oh, ah, oh, it's his bed. Oh, that will hurt bare skin. I'm not going down there. And then they've got. Is this still Toy Story? Oh no. No, I think it's like cruise ship vibes. This is cruise ship vibes. With it. Oh. <laughs> what does this do? Uh, I don't know, it creates some bubbles. Creates bubbles. Cool. And then who's in there? <laughs> <laughs> and then they've got all kind of things for you to play with over here. Oh wow! <laughs> does that Mickey horn. the Mickey horn? No, that's not the Mickey Horn. No? No. no. What about them? Are they Mickey Horns? No. Oh, I sailor! <laughs> Got little slides, drawing bits. The Avengers room. This looks pretty cool because they've got all the stuff. Iron Man helmet, Black Widow gauntlet, spider web, web, Spider-Man web shooters, <laughs> Ant-Man helmet. To be a kid, I feel like a kid to be honest. But it's so cool. We have the toilets for the kids. And then you've got Wandering Oaken's Trading Post. There's his sauna. <laughs> oh, well, you can't go in. <laughs> Oaken sauna. You can't get in though, sadly. Uh, but it's so good that all these kids' rooms are included in your cruise fare price. It's brilliant. <laughs> well, hello everyone. We may have forgotten to finish off the vlog on the cruise. So this is future us now back home. Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, so if you've made it this far in the video, thank you very much. Yeah, thanks. I apologise if it's a bit bitty, but this is the first time that we've kind of done a vlog, a travel vlog. So we're both learning on how to record. And remembering to record. Remembering to record. <laughs> the sections to record. And also how to edit. It's totally new, so... Please bear with us. Please bear with us. And thanks. We will be filming a merch haul of all the things we bought in Ulani and also on the cruise so enjoy that video when it comes out hopefully next week and also in January we are going to Walt Disney World, Walt Disney World! Woo! Florida and we will be staying at Wilderness Lodge and Animal Kingdom Lodge if you've enjoyed the video <laughs> please like it <laughs> Because, <laughs> Wait, no, with the again. thumb thing in the YouTube thing, <laughs> oh, if you've enjoyed watching it, please press the like button, thumb. And subscribe. Because it does help Thank with the YouTube-ness. So we've arrived in Sydney <laughs> in the next clip. Yeah. So enjoy that. It's arriving in the dark at half past three in the morning we got up. 
It was very cold, very windy. Very cold, very windy. So I have muted the audio because all you can hear is <laughs> So enjoy this relaxing moment and thank Welcome you for to Australia. <laughs> so enjoy <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Stop laughing. Oh. <clears throat> Now what? So enjoy this relaxing moment and welcome to Sydney, Australia. <laughs>